Hello fellow Grantologists, welcome back to another vloggity vlog. My name is Grant Uchida and today I am running late for work. This is gonna be the first day that I'm actually going to my wedding company job with you. Uh, the job is called Isle Media. They're really cool. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. Oh, I forgot to shave today, damn it. Hopefully they don't get too weirded out that I'm bringing in a giant camera. I mean, it's a wedding company. You're supposed to have big giant cameras, right? Why is there no park? Oh, here we go. Morning. Hi. Now that I'm done with work, I'm gonna head off to meet my friend Selena down at Ala Moana. Reading your comments, you guys seem to really like the vlog. What do you guys think of the sunglasses? I've been trying to figure out for the longest time what pair of sunglasses like fits my head or like fits me, matches my persona in general. You know, like I, I will tell you a story a little later on about why I have so many pairs of sunglasses. I feel like there's something I needed to talk to you guys about, but I can't remember. Oh yeah, it was my second job. I'm sorry, I left you hanging on day three. The job bite squad, it worked out okay. The first delivery was really nerve-wracking. Second delivery was okay. Third delivery was a little better than the fourth delivery was kind of like crazy because I couldn't find the way into the apartment or the, the hotel and then I had to call them and then they got all upset. But I don't know, it was like some rich old lady. All in all, like it's a job that makes me feel really uncomfortable, but I think that I need that. I need to step out of my comfort zone a lot more. Doing these daily vlogs are helping. I mean, just walking around with a camera is something that I don't think a lot of people People do so therefore you know people look at you funny but I think that that's all the beauty of it is not really caring what other people think and just being you <coughs> sadly I thought that I could work at bite squad for like maybe one or two days a week because it said on the schedule set your own hours I didn't think that by setting your own hours it meant you actually had to work a minimum well, I mean I guess that that would make sense that you should work a minimum of 18 hours a week but now having two jobs, both of them 18 hours a week. I'm now working full time. I guess it'll be interesting. I'm not sure how many adventures I can go on with you guys because I was really excited to take you guys out on a, a great adventure here and there. We do have some interesting things coming up in the future. Traffic. Oh God. I didn't even drink a Zions today. What the hell? Whoops. I didn't see that. Oh uh, no, they blocked off the road again. Damn it. Oh, it's gonna be so difficult getting into the mall. Like, look at this, guys. Look. This is what Hawaii does every single weekday. They block off one lane going this way and... Whoa, God. And they leave it like that for cars to free up the, the cars on the other side of the road. But there are no cars on the other side of the road, so what the hell? Like, we're stuck. We're, we're crammed up in two lanes over here. Oh, there are the cars. There are the cars. Yeah, they're really jam-packed. Look at how little space they have in between each other. They're full on bumper to bumper. Not like us over here where we're just, we're, we've got a lot of space, don't we? We're just perfectly fine with only two lanes and they get like four, three, I don't know. <coughs> Why do you do this, Hawaii? Every single day, this is what our tax paying dollars go to. Putting cones on the middle of the road to make it Look, look, there's nobody in this lane. Like, who putting cones up like this, I'm sure that that won't clog up the traffic going the opposite way. I mean, I, I don't, I'm no, I'm no scientist, but I, I guess it's scientifically proven that whatever the state decides is right. This guy in the back is just like chilling. He's like looking at me and it's kind of awkward, but I have my sunglasses on, so it's okay. He, he thinks that I'm probably filming him, and I am. Said that Hawaii has one of the worst traffic situations in the entire state. Probably because it's we, we inflict it on ourselves Because of these cones that we put down every single day to just clog up traffic on this side. When there's barely any traffic on that side. <laughs> See, now instead of simply just being able to turn left, I have to loop around to get to the mall. No, no, I'm making it. I'm going. I don't care about you, lady. I'm going. Oh, this person is taking their sweet old time going, and it's a yellow light. God damn it. Okay, here we go. Now, I have to turn, and then we can go directly into the mall. Problem with this congestion over here is that 
oftentimes we're stuck creeping into the middle of the road like so. Sometimes the light will turn yellow and we'll be stuck in the middle of the road. Luckily today is not so. This person is gonna have a really hard time getting into that lane. So I'm gonna go over here. Are you going to... Nope, you're not. Okay, I'm gonna turn here. Thank you very much. I'm going over here. I'm going up the ramp. So I don't have to deal with having to deal with the pedestrians. This is really cool. Like this stuff right here. What it does is it calculates how many cars are in every level. If you can tell, like look up like that, there's a lot of levels. So what it does is it basically shows us... Oh, there's a thousand... 921 open stalls here instead of having to play freaking guessing game of, of finding parking we can actually go over here <laughs> look at this okay parking level three it seems like it has 117 available spots so we'll go here now that minimizes the chance of having to deal with finding parking oh look there's a parking space right there I'm just gonna go over here like this and I'm gonna reverse into it because I like to reverse into parking spaces so I don't have to deal with having to like reverse out. Tips on driving 101 is you can kids learn how to drive like a boss. Freaking cause mayhem on the road. Okay, we're here. Let's go. Headbutt. So as I said before, we're here to meet up with my friend Selena. Oh, why did I bring my jacket? I don't need my jacket. Does the picture look better or worse? I put a polarized lens on here, meaning that the lighting should be better now. Let me let me show you an example. I can't really see it too well, but you can kind of see that, right? Can you see the transition? It's like bright now, or it's bright now, and then it gets darker, and it's a little, the colors pop a little more. That's what a polarized lens does, and that's what we have on here. I've heard that it makes your everything kind of darker. That's great English right there. And I'm just wondering, like, what do you guys think of the lighting? Is it okay? I think it's okay. Uh, this thing is all dirty. Hello. Hello, I'm here. Hi. Longs? Okay, I'll be at Longs. I'm gonna get a Zions anyway, so I'll meet you at Longs. Hello. Hello, I am here with my friend Selena. Technically, this is the first time that you guys are gonna meet her, but we've actually had, had uh, past videos together, which you will see in the future. Time travel vlog. Ooh. For me, it was on sale. Oh, what is it? It's a bralette. Oh. And it's so pretty. Ooh. Oh, oh no. Shit. Oh no. You're hungry. Yeah. I'm hungry. Yeah. But we don't know when the bank closes. Yes. So we probably should figure out when the bank closes and then get food. Okay, we can <laughs> go to the bank. Okay, it's yeah, let's. Right okay, well. Right? That's <laughs> the one. Yeah, on yeah, the, the box, one down. Right? Yeah. yeah. Go. Okay, all right, would you adventure time? Okay, so where are we gonna eat? Well, down there there's a Korean restaurant called uh -huh. Chodan. Okay. Oh, Chodan, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. Chodan, 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 whatever. whatever. Yeah. Okay, you wanna eat there? there? Yeah. Cheap. Let's do it. We'll go there after yeah, we go to the yeah, bank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, go. Go. Um, I can um, make it. Um. Oh. oh, this way, this way, this way. It's so bright. Oh. You got it? Okay. Are you full? Yeah. Okay. Off to Walmart. I can't see what you're doing. What do you do? Is it fit? Oh, it fits. <laughs> Wait, where'd you put it? I can't, <laughs> I can't see. I hope it doesn't fall. For my Zion's collection. Oh yeah, Valentine's Day is coming up. Here. Oh. Um, not sympathy card. Get well card. Oh, I need oh. blank ones. And then... No, get this one. Ooh. Why are they all open? Like oh. the sticker. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> What's that? It's glue. I'm gonna make, um, I'm gonna try and make slime. <laughs> <laughs> like fluffy slime, because it's only three ingredients. You need glue, uh, shaving cream, and contact lens solution. Oh, and it makes fluffy make slime. fluffy slime. Yeah, so I'm gonna get this. Okay. Yeah. If any of you guys want to make fluffy slime, remember those three ingredients. Yeah. Subscribe to my channel. <laughs> no. What's your channel? <laughs> There's a John oh, Cena no. shirt. <laughs> I didn't even see that. 
<laughs> we concluded the errand portion of this vlog. Yay. Yeah, and you got no time to hang out? Maybe a few minutes. A few minutes? Okay. We'll, we'll spend our last moments doing something fun and then thus concludes Adventure Time with Selena and Grant. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. Well, this is the end of the vlog. We just ended up watching Markiplier and PewDiePie. <laughs> <Yeah. so. laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Once again, my name is Gran Uchida. If you would like to become a Grantologist today, please subscribe and refer a friend. That helps me out a lot. And I will see you bright and early tomorrow morning for another adventure. Take care, guys. Bye. Head by What's that? <laughs> come, come see us at Teddy's. Sure, I'll take one. Take her to Teddy's and she'll love you forever. All right, sounds good. Thank you. <laughs>